Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to Persona for the PlayStation Portable. So the last time I recorded, we got to this point. We're almost at the boss fight. And um, off screen, I did grind a whole lot. We have like a ton of yen now. And as far as personas go, I did go to the Velvet Room and fuse a couple of different personas. For instance, Johnny Utah has Urvashi. Uh, Maki, that's her name. Maki has Futai. And we gave Nanjo Quetzalcoatl. And poor Mark still has his uh, beginning persona. I didn't fuse anything for him. So hopefully that's not going to like come back and bite us in the butt later. But I think we're just supposed to keep going this way. Uh, that's a dead end. Crap, I went the wrong way. <laughs> and of course we get ambushed. So these guys are weak to mostly guns, so we're going to do that. Yeah, as you can see, we're pretty strong now. Uh, because grinding off screen really helps a lot. Crap, where are we supposed to go? We're supposed to go up, I think. Right? Or did I come from here? I came from here. How do I get to... The other area. I got ambushed again. It's no problem. These guys are chumps. I thought it was supposed to keep going that way, but I guess not. Yeah, because that is a dead end if I've ever seen one. So we're going to go... Or should I go this way? I think I'm supposed to go this way. <laughs> ah, crap. Um, I guess we're going to use guns again. Ah, crap. Mark is getting low on health. I didn't even realize that. You with your healing powers. It's all good. This... Battle's gonna take a little bit of time, but we'll get through it. No worries. Alright, yeah, I think we're supposed to go up these stairs over here. Before I do that, though, I'm gonna heal, um... I guess I'll heal everybody. Especially Mark, because he is about to drop dead. All right. Let's go this way. Let's see where this goes. Yeah, this looks like uncharted territory. Okay, those guys are always pretty easy to take care of. So let's keep on going this way. I guess we'll go downstairs again. I hope I'm going the right way. <laughs> because in this episode, I want to get to the final boss fight of this area and take care of him before we progress the story anymore. I really, really, really hope we're going the right way. Actually, I am going to talk to this guy. I think we have his card, yeah. He's usually kind of a uh, bad time to take care of. All right. We will use... Whoops. Auto. Got to remember how to play this game because it's been a little while. It's been a couple of weeks because of all the holiday shenanigans. I managed to get myself caught up in the whole Southwest Airlines meltdown thing. So that was a uh, that was a fun time. I actually got to spend some time with a good friend of mine because I got stuck in the same city that he lives in. <laughs> so I guess it's better than getting stuck in the airport for days at a time, like many people did. 
All right, let's take care of these guys. They're pretty easy. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We are doing good. Let's keep on trucking. We'll go this way. The stairs keep on going down. I wonder if I'm going the right way. Or if this is just, like, extra stuff. Uh, I guess we'll inscribe our story. And keep on going. It looks like there's some other rooms around here. a store. I don't think I need anything. Ah, oh, that's literally all that was down here was, like, stores and stuff. Yeah, we're just dropping by, Trish. We didn't mean to come this way. Whoopsie! Dang it. <laughs> All right. I mean, I know we're supposed to keep going up to the top floor, but... I don't know how to do that right now. Pretty sure these are dead ends. No, this goes up. Okay. This actually looks promising. I think we're going the right way, guys. Do I, um, I wonder if I have these guys spell cards. No, I don't. Okay, we're just gonna shoot them. So yeah, pretty sure we're going the right way. Um, because these stairs look like they were leading upwards, which is where we need to be going. Oh crap, Johnny Utah is almost done for. So is Nanjo. Hey, Jill. Okay, let's heal up a little bit before we continue. Because we want to be in tip-top condition before we fight this uh, boss man. I'm going to drop a quick save. And let's go upstairs. Yeah, this is the right way. I can almost guarantee it. fifth floor so this is the boss area so I'm gonna save just in case we for some reason don't succeed in our efforts here <laughs> which I don't think we're gonna have a problem but it's always kind of nerve-wracking when you get to a boss fight all right let's go in I can hear voices it sounds like someone's talking inside Takeda's voice I'm sorry, Mr. Kandori. The woman escaped. That was a mistake, Takeda. Well, leave her be. There's nowhere for her to go. It's more important that the scientists finish the Davis system's adjustments. Yes, sir. He's definitely in there. Are you ready, Johnny? We are ready to rock. I'm gonna save again. All right. Who's there? More children? How did you get in here? This is a disgrace, Takeda. First that brat, and now this. When did my company become a nursery? I see you haven't changed, Kandori. You're like an ass in a lion's skin. Pushing your luck, aren't you? 
Does President Psyche know about this? My, my, the young master of the Nanjo group. No, the old man knows nothing. But this is preposterous. Your mother would spank you if she knew you had stooped to breaking and entering. Or is that your senile butler's job? Silence. You don't think I'll easily forgive this. Yo, quit grandstanding, man. You're gonna pay for what you did. This guy's... Kandori? Undisciplined children are no better than dumb beasts. Takeda. Take them from my sight. Do it however you like. Just don't make a mess. Mr. Kandori, please step back. Alright. Don't let a single one of them escape. Kandori! What a surprise. I didn't expect that you'd be a Persona users as well. What? Don't tell me. You too? Takeda, I leave this to you. You can handle a few children, hmm? Yes, sir. You're going nowhere. Oh, no, you don't. Damn, kids. You're not taking one step out of here. Now, taste the power of my persona. Kind of sucks that, like... Takeda gets like a, uh, a one hit on the whole party before you start the fight. So keep that in mind uh, whenever you go into this battle. Alright, so let's take our time here and see what we got going on. Skill, we're going to use our Mabufala, which is medium ice damage, plus freeze to all foes, which all of these guys are weak to ice, I'm pretty sure. Uh, Maki... You can use your ice damage as well. It only applies to an area, so we'll just go with these guys. Medium blast damage. So that affects everybody, and then you with your beginner persona still. <laughs> I guess we'll, uh, you can use gravity, light gravity damage to all foes. Let's do it. Not bad. You missed. You suck. Oh, that does such good damage. Yep, they're definitely weak to ice. <laughs> Almost done for. Alright, we'll just redo that. Pretty sure they're going to be gone after this turn. Yeah, it's just... Just this guy left. Uh oh. Persona time? Just like that, folks. Just like that. Alright, so. Nobody leveled up. Usually after a boss fight, everybody levels up, but oh well. Oh no, that's Persona Awakenings, my bad. That prick? Where'd he go? There's no sign that he used the door. There must be another way out. That's Kandori, huh? Where have I... Hmm? What's up, Maki? You look all down. Huh? Uh, oh, I'm, I'm okay. It's nothing. Come on, let's hurry after him. Alright. Man, who'd have thought he was another Persona user? I mean, I could have seen that coming. 
It's nothing, really. I just felt a little faint. But thanks for worrying about me. There must be another way out. I'll keep watch. Find the exit. Quickly. Okay. So I'm pretty sure... That there is a button over here somewhere. Yeah. It's a switch. Press it. Yes. Bingo. Good work, Johnny. A hidden path, eh? He seems to love his cheap tricks. Johnny, let's hurry after him. All right. Let's hurry after him. So we need to get out of here, so I think we have to go dungeon crawling again. Or no, we have to dungeon crawl in the basement. Yeah. This is almost certainly a tree, yep. So I'll drop a, a hard save really quickly. And then we'll keep on going. After Kandori. Oop. <laughs> Alright, new enemies. So I don't know what any of these guys are going to do. So we'll just use our replay personas again. Ah, oh, didn't turn uh, animations off. There we go. Okay, well, these guys aren't too much more uh, powerful than the other ones in the previous area. I'm gonna use some heals, though, because uh, Johnny Utah is getting pretty low. Is it me, or does the audio sound weird? I feel like I hear something in the background. Okay, I'm all healed up, right? Because I'm pretty sure these boxes here are trapped. No. Not that one, anyway. Yeah, that one is. Titanium guard. Oh, I should have healed. All right. Let's look at our equipment. So he's got optimal Maki. Looks like he already had optimal. Give you a titanium guard, Nanjo, and you get a titanium guard. Okay. What's my health look like? All right, not bad. Okay, let's uh, drop a save and then we'll keep going. Underground laboratory. Underground. <laughs> Dang it. Oh, yeah, dude, you guys give so much XP. I love running into these guys. Oh, wow. Let's heal again. Actually, I'm going to use some medicine this time because uh, I'll just use a medicine here. All right, we're good. More scientists. Dr. Nikolai seems to have been planning to stop Kandori, but what can we do? Was that high school boy a friend of yours? I'm sorry to say he was... I think he's talking about Reiji. None of us predicted that demons would emerge in town. Though it presents a rather intriguing situation, don't you think? No, this is... scary. <laughs> it sounds like someone from St. Hermelin's snuck in here before us. 
Don't these guys feel guilty at all for what they did? I mean, a couple of them seem to feel guilty. That Kandori, he's gone too far. Uh, is this door open? No. All right. Oh, yeah. Cool, more men in black. They're pretty easy to take care of, so, uh... And they give good XP, so I'm not complaining. Oh my goodness. Okay. So yeah, this is like a dark room. You gotta like do something weird. Oh boy. Crap. Oh. There we go. We're doing fine. I guess you can't really see the map because the webcam's in the way, but... Yeah, you can kind of see it. Alright, we made it out of the dark room. Ooh, okay. I'm pretty sure I can contact these guys in the back row. Yeah, alright. Get out of here, guys. We got some men in black to take care of. Only two of you now. Nani. Okay, uh... There's nothing that way, obviously, so we're gonna go into this room to find some more scientists. I don't see Dr. Nikolai anywhere. I knew he had his own secret projects, but he must have been in with Kandori. Is Kandori planning on staying in a safe lo location while the demons get us? <laughs> Probably. At this rate, all our valuable test data will be uh, ruined. My precious research. Buddy, I don't give a damn about your research. Let's get that Kandori and bring this town back to normal. Johnny, are your weapons ready? We won't let them escape this time. Oh, dude, my weapons have been so ready this whole time. I feel like I've seen this place before. All right. I took literally two steps. The demon spoke to you. All right, what do you got to say, man? Well, I'd say our meeting here must have been fate. Give me something to remember today by. I'm short on cash. Give me 1,700 yen. Okay. Thanks, man. Uh, they're joyful and haughty. Let's sing. Happy. I want to make him eager again. How do I do that? Invite? Oh no. We'll just sing again. Sing more! Oh, he's scared. Um, okay, Maki... Uh, flatter. Angry? I thought you were joyful and haughty. <laughs> okay, um... You're gonna have to dance crazy. Oh no, seductive slow dance. Okay, that made him happy. Do it again. I like the smell of blood I'm sniffing. I'll listen to you. <laughs> spell card, hit me. Cool, we got a spell card. And amethyst. Okay, we got your spell card. That's all I wanted. Usually when you talk to a demon, that's like the main thing you want to get is the spell card because you can fuse them later. And if you run into them, you can tell them to shove off and get out of here. All right, we're in the Deva system chamber. Oh, there he is. 
Dr. Nikolai, are the adjustments complete? <laughs> oh, man. Look at this guy. Please reconsider this, Mr. Kandori. Stop the system and atone for your sins. Dr. Nikolai, the genius scientist who developed the Deva system. Preposterous. It's the rest of mankind that must atone. What I've done here is nothing more than to facilitate that process. But that young man, you didn't have to send him into the dimensional rift. What did you hope to gain by throwing away a child's life? I won't allow anyone to stand in my way, not even a child. Judgment will come regardless. It's only a question of sooner or later. Well, Kandori, you're a dork. <laughs> you're not going anywhere, mister. Mark, you're even more of a dork. Now listen here, mister. You ain't going nowhere. You're not taking a step out of here. You hear me say? Ah, it's the dork from earlier. I had a feeling you'd come, so you beat Takeda. He always was useless. Your time has come, Kandori. Loud noises from young children. I don't have time for you. I have matters to attend to. Come, Dr. Nikolai. Wait. So, this is the Deva system? What are Kandori's plans for this? This machine? I... Where do I know this thing from? I don't know, Maki. Where do you know it from? Gah! What the... <sighs> What's happening? Gah! I... I'm disappearing! Nikolai! What's happening? It's over, sir. You and I are going down together. For your treachery, for your crimes, for all mankind, you will atone. Nikolai, you swine! How dare you betray me! Young man, if we are reduced to our component atoms, the system will stop. The barrier enclosing this town will be released. Leave us and escape. You out there, boy, stop the system. Come on, old man. You don't have to throw away your life or throw your life away. Let's save him. There's no need for the old guy to die just because of Kandori. We'll smack down Kandori ourselves. That's what we came here for, right? Wait. The old ma man must have invented the system. He's taking responsibility. We should respect his wishes. We don't even know how to stop the machine. Johnny, here, this'll stop the machine. <laughs> the blue button increases the output, but the red button is the emergency stop. If you push it, we can save him. Maki, where did you learn that? I don't know how I know. I just know. Johnny, hurry. All right, so um, we're at a crossroads here, and you can either save the old man, Dr. Nikolai, or uh, press the blue button and not save him. We're going to save him. We're going to attempt to save him because that's what uh, a good group of high school persona-wielding user people would do, right? We can save him if you push the red button. Red pill or blue pill? <laughs> What's it going to be? All right, let's press the red button. N no way. It didn't stop. What in the... I'm rematerializing. I see. It's you. You're calling for me. How can this be? 
My plan should have worked perfectly. Don't tell me. Is she... You! I won't let you kill my daddy. Let's leave now, daddy. <laughs> I refuse to die. Now, take me to your world. Whoa. W what the... Kandori. Well then, what a plot twist. So who is this little girl? Calling Kandori daddy. Uh, looks like we're going back to see, uh, Mr. Philemon. No? Okay. <laughs> Look at Nanjo. <laughs> Just arms completely, sp like, sprawled out. Ow! We're in the old gym. Maki, uh, are you okay? Uh. M Seo? Uh. Where am I? Oh, Johnny, you all right? Looks like everyone's unhurt. We certainly have the devil's luck. Hey, isn't this the school gym? The one they tore down six months ago? I get it. We've gone back. Gone back? To six months ago? Come on, Maki, snap out of it. Okay, Mark, look. After all the things that have happened to us already, like, you wouldn't... You would Okay. I mean, it's completely plausible that we've gone back in time at this point. I mean, there's been demons, there's been personas. <laughs> you mean a time slip? That's rather different than what your mother said. I've told you before, I don't have a real mom. I never thought the stuff Yosuke was saying was actually true. Oh, there you are. It's really bad, Maki. Yosuke got seriously hurt. That girl in black came back again. No way. Th that's impossible. Yosuke. H hey, Maki. Could Yosuke be that guy who went missing a couple of months ago? You know, that really hot buff guy that's cooler than me? Oh. <laughs> that dolt. I can't believe she took off on her own at a time like this. Come on, Johnny. We'd better go after Maki. Again. Ah, ha, ha. Ha, ha, ha. Ah. It looked like you guys showed up out of nowhere. I must have been dreaming. Ha, 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 ha. Johnny? Don't you think Maki is acting oddly for an amnesia victim? Is this really six months ago? That girl did come here looking for Maki. But Maki was hospitalized six months ago as well. I think Maki likes Yosuke. I'm jealous. They'd make a cute couple. You there. How many days are left until the sports festival? Ugh, you're always so rude. The sports festival is still a month off. You have amnesia or something, Nanjo? So, the date's the same. Tell me, which year am I in? What the? You really do have amnesia. We're all second-year students. 
Man, I gotta tell the others about this. Everything's the same as when we left. Stranger and stranger. Yosuke, huh? I get it. Oh, uh, what's up, Johnny? So, this has turned into a, uh, sci-fi mystery novel very quickly. Let's go to the old gym stage. Who's back here? Ballet club member. Hey, you better not be here to peep on us. <laughs> Hell no. I wouldn't do that. Can't we get our own room? Then we wouldn't have to deal with this crap. I told you already, I didn't come here to peep on you fools. You're getting rather worked up over something so trivial, Masao. Let's go. Yeah, I think in one of the previous episodes, um, we did go into like the ballet club's room or something, and they were talking about being happy that they have a room now because people have been peeping on them. So I guess that was us. I doubt Kandori will stay this quiet. Heaven knows what he'll do next. Huh. There's no hole here. Oh yeah, the hole's gone. Why does that girl keep attacking the school? Does she have some kind of grudge? So these guys know about the girl? Doesn't that girl in black look like someone we know? Hmm... All right, so we're back in the school, apparently six months ago. So I guess we'll walk around and do some exploring. Uh, although there seems to be no one here. All right, so here's Nurse Natsumi. Oh, Johnny, did you hurt yourself? Oh, it's Nurse Natsumi. Miss Psycho seems to be silent. Ah, Miss Psycho. It feels as though we haven't seen you in a while. She's... she's all depressed. Hmm. Huh? Hey, what's wrong, Miss Psycho? And don't just say you overate again. Even Miss Sayako is acting strangely. If you're not feeling well, come to the infirmary. Let's have a look at you. So I guess she is the healing person in the area. All right, that should do it. Don't let the demons get you, okay? So everyone in six months ago knows about demons, apparently. And I guess we'll drop a save really quickly. Oops. Let's uh, explore the school some more, see uh, see what anybody else has to say around here. Oh, hey guys, it's the principal. Oh, did something happen, Johnny? Don't tell me that girl in black showed up again. No, that's not it, but who's this girl in black you mentioned? You haven't heard about her, Kay? A girl in black clothes has been appearing. It only started happening recently, but they say she controls demons. Whoa, there are demons over here too? But don't worry, Principal Oishi and I will protect you children. Wh what the hell? Why is Hamya being so nice to us? Uh, um, we gotta get going. So yeah, if you remember uh, Mr. Hamya, a.k.a. Hamya, or Hanya, a.k.a. Hamya, uh, was a very mean principal or assistant principal. So it's uh, quite odd that he's being nice to us all of a sudden. 
So I guess the entire school is completely empty. We're gonna check anyway. Oh! Somebody's here! Smitten girl. Oh, hey, um, I saw this really cool guy a second ago. I've never seen him before. A transfer student, maybe? Oh man, who is he? I don't know, who could it be? I bet somewhere out there there's a girl watching me from afar, too. What nonsense. Thanks for the input, Nanjo. Uh, have we gone this way? Yeah. Alright. Let's go upstairs. Let's see, see if there's anybody around here. Somebody's in this room. Okay. Yuko, you're looking smug. My father's going to hire me a bodyguard so I don't get attacked by demons. Why don't you get one too? Oh, I suppose that's impossible for you. Hmm. It would cost quite a bit of money after all. So sorry. Yuko Himeno, you knew her as a kind girl working part-time to support her family, but... That was Yuko, right? Am I seeing things? Did she used to be like that? Oh my, Nanjo. Are you still mingling with that sort? It's not as though I enjoy it. Shut up, Nanjo. You like being our friends. That sort? Is she talking about us? True, they're a pack of imbeciles and could be considered that sort. But then why does it anger me so to hear others say it? Because you're our friend, man. This is what friendship feels like, Nanjo. <laughs> What do you mean, that sort? We're hoodlums. We're ruffians, man. We're, uh... Uh... Near duels. <laughs> what on earth? Did your dinner disagree with you, Yuko? <laughs> in other words, who pissed in your Cheerios? Yes, what is it? Don't speak to me without a good reason. Hmm. I can't stand Yuko. Why is Maki still friends with her anyway? Everyone loves Maki and everyone hates Yuko, but oddly enough, they're friends. Well then... So Yuko is a bit different six months ago. Uh, okay. Let's check these rooms. This is the cafeteria, I think. No one's here. All right. What about this room? And what about this room? Maybe this one. Oh, someone's here. Injured boy. Johnny? Is it really you? I didn't think I'd see people from the original world here. Yosuke Naito. A ladies' man who went missing along with Chisato Kasai two months ago. What? Oh, don't tell me. Are you Yosuke Naito? The guy who went missing? Yeah, that's me. About two months ago, Chisato... She and I wandered into this world. I'm from the same place you are. You said this world... Then this isn't the past, but another dimension? Or another world, yes? Yeah, I thought it was the past too at first. Everything here is exactly the same as it was a year ago. Some things are weird, though. The police station turned into a forest, and the hospital is a castle. And Maki there was just like you see her. Yeah, it was practically a paradise until last month. A parallel world. The many worlds theory, where countless similar worlds exist. Seriously? We thought you ran off with Chisato, but you were in another world. I want to say that's completely nuts, 
but then again, we're in the same boat. It's hard to believe, but it isn't out of the question for the Davis system. Yeah, I can see that. I didn't think you'd bring back this world's Maki, though. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You're saying Maki really is Maki, but not the one we know. I'm sorry. I wasn't trying to lie. I was just wasn't sure until I got back here. I never even thought there was another world, let alone that I'd go over to it. I see. No wonder your words and actions seemed to miss. I was dozing off in class, and when I woke up, I was in another world. I didn't figure it out until much later. Oh, man. Then the real Maki is still somewhere in that hospital. Couldn't you have at least said something, uh, Maki? I'm sorry, I really am. But if I did mention it, would you have believed me? I just thought if we beat Kandori, both worlds would go back to normal. So she knew all along. That's why I figured I'd wait until it was all over to tell you. Huh. Wait a sec. I don't see Chisato. Where is she? Chisato was... Well, that girl in black took her. Damn it. Don't tell me. It's that girl again. Ah ha 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 ha. I'm gonna bring down this dumb school for sure this time. I took away the exits. Now no one can escape. Ah ha ha. There's no mistaking that voice. It's that girl. Did you say she removed the exits? If demons show up now, we'll be slaughtered. Damn it. I gotta go. Wait, Yosuke. Don't strain yourself. Everyone, give me a hand. We have to do something. I'm not sure what's going on here, but at this rate, we can get outside. Let's do this, Johnny. All right, let's uh, let's help. I I wonder if I should actually progress the story right now because we haven't gotten uh, what's his name, Ragey on our team yet. Uh, actually, I think that's part of a scripted event that's going to happen, so we'll just keep on doing the story. There's no use sitting around and worrying over this. we got to take action and find a way back home. What say you, Nanjo? What sort of relationship does that girl have with Kandori? There's too little data to draw a useful conclusion. That girl must be somewhere in the school. Don't let your guard down just because she's a kid. She has strange powers. Damn it. If only I wasn't so banged up, I could get Chisato back this time. Huh? My wounds? Oh, the last time that little girl was here, she kicked my ass. Man, talk about pathetic. That's all good. All, everyone gets their ass kicked by a small child every now and then. Happens to the best of us. Oh yeah, so the school is a hostile environment now. So, oh yeah, and it's different. The layout's different. <laughs> uh, all right, new, new enemies have appeared. Uh-oh. Oh, boy. So we're not going to do that. I guess they absorb everything. So let's use our guns. Oh, that does, like, so little damage. And we're getting them. Oh, no. Okay, we're good. I thought that was going to turn into, like, an endless cycle. All right, let's, um, let's do some healing. Maki, I'm glad you're still with us, actually. Okay, okay, let's go this way. It's a velvet room. I don't need to talk to Igor right now, I don't think.
And this is a tree. Oh, it's the clinic or infirmary. Oh, hi, Johnny. What's going on out there? I don't know what to do. I'm in a real fix. Right, Miss Saiko? The silent treatment, huh? I thought she'd at least speak up at a time like this, but she's still down. Let's find that girl. She must be somewhere in the school. Why is that girl attacking the school? What does she hope to gain? When are we gonna go get to rescue the real Maki? Uh, I guess you're gonna heal us, aren't you? Yeah. Alright. Miss Saiko, what do you have to say for yourself? Nothing? Cool. Oops. Alright, so I suppose we will drop a save right here. And, uh, we'll go ahead and call it for this episode. That's all the time I have for it. And, uh, we're at a good stopping point anyway. So when we come back, we will venture out into this now hostile St. Hermelin in search of the little girl who has been terrorizing this alternate dimension's students in school and whatnot and um i guess we're gonna confront her and see what happens next so as always thanks for watching and i'll see you on the next one bye